Hello everyone, welcome back to TechGlob YouTube channel. In this demonstration, I'm going to show you how to deploy the software to the multiple device on your organization. For using the deployment service, the software deployment services are invaluable for efficiently managing and distributing software across an organization network. And also automated deployment streamlines the process of installing software on multiple devices, reducing the time and effort needed for manual installation. So let's get started without any delay. So in this case, I have selected two computer for the demonstration purpose, which is Windows Server 2025, and also I have Windows 11 computer okay so now first of all I'm gonna open the start menu and selecting the server manager in the server manager click on tools and selecting the active directory users and computers gonna create organizational unit then I'm going to type here hrpz So inside the HR container, I'm going to create a new user. So after this, open the C drive, then creating a new folder. And the folder name deploy software. And I'm going to share this folder and also I download from the internet the Microsoft Teams software it's a MSI file then I'm going to copy in the C drive I'm gonna open the server manager again click on tools then go to group policy management and uh, under the group policy management I'm gonna expand the domain and uh, expand the domain name again right click on the HR container and I'm going to create a new GPO on the HR container right click and create a GPO software deployment then click on OK expand the HR container then right click on the software deployment and select edit and under the user configuration policies expand the policies and expand the software setting And select the software installation right click and select new and select package then I'm gonna select the Microsoft teams okay so then click on yes and select assigned then click on ok So let me refresh here. It will take few seconds to uh, visible the software. And now here you can see the Teams is assigned. All right. So after this, uh, open the run command and type CMD and enter the group policy update. So once you have update the group policy uh, go to the client computer let me check here whether the software is visible or not okay so first of all I'm gonna select the other user so I'm gonna enter new username Lyra 
at tag globe dot local and the password so let's check whether the team software is installed or not let me type in the start menu now here you can see we got the installation the software is uh, installed successfully if the software is not yet uh, installed in your client computer update the group policy on the client machine also okay and that's it for this demonstration dear all viewers if you like this video please do comments in my channel don't forget to subscribe like and share see you in the next video